What's up guys and girls, welcome back to the wonderful world of Watch Dogs 2. Last time we hacked space. We went up, took control of satellites, dismantled Bloom from above, and who knows where this game goes from here. Thanks for your support. I appreciate each and every one of you. We got a bunch of new missions to tackle. There's a whole lot of stuff, so we just kind of kind of decide the order we want to do it in. Um, we got a bunch of new main missions. We've got Shanghai, Robot Wars, and Power to the Sheeple. Robots? I mean, they're in the freaking name of the channel, so I think we gotta do Robot Wars, drop the baby, meet Wrench at the garage, DeadSec plans to get inside Titus proper, and expose their secret programs. But to get past security, we need a plan. Since we're dealing with Titus, the plan needs to be bulletproof. And this is one of the companies that we gained info on from our outer space satellite hack. So we're gonna go meet Wrench at the garage, which is a ways away. We might be able to fast travel there. I don't think we can. We'll just drive there then. Um, but since I'm Ghost Robo, I figured, like... Freaking Robot Wars is where we had to begin. We'll do Power to the Sheeple and Shanghai, obviously, as well as I get situated here in my recording chair and ready to tackle whatever the dogs throw at us. It's a sunshiny day and no one's here. Hilarious how when it's dark out, everyone's here. I guess they're at work? Maybe that's the explanation? Okay. Um, I do like that you can bring, like, say you want a car right here for you. You're like, yo, whoa, okay, it's a, okay, it's a little far, a little far, a little far. Okay, stop. Stop, whoa, stop. Okay, goodness gracious, sakes alive. That car is a little bit crazy, but I'm glad that we got in it now, and let's try not to kill anyone, okay. We gotta make sure that we make a plan, since it sounds like this is gonna be a tricky mission. Robots involved, maybe we get to control one of uh, the little robots, since Wrench has one of his own. I wonder if it involves something like that. We shall see. It also makes me uh, think about how in Watch Dogs 1 there was like that weird giant robot attack mini game. So who knows what we got going on here. Here is the garage. Go see what Wrench is cooking up for us here. Hello my friend. Sorry. Golly goodness. My bad. My bad. My bad. Oh. His robot. I bet we do get to use it. And he's got a picture of his freaking donut shop girl over there. We want to go after Titus, okay? Uh, robotics? Yeah, yeah. You find something in the data dump? Yeah, um, okay, well, let's just say that all the, the taxes and the government grants and the research programs, you'll notice the Koi signs there, none of it adds up, okay? They're, they're collaborating with Bloom on something they call the 10-year plan. Again, Koi signs, hmm. which is supposed to improve CTOS security. Then why are they filing patents on military tech, Because right? CTOS is going the way of all control systems. That's why Junior here is a little bot on a mission. No, he's not. That is not your fucking call! Wait, you think you're just gonna skip through Titus's front door and steal all their dirty secrets? Even Uncle Sam buys his biometric locks from Titus. That's the level of security we're dealing with, amigo. A palm reader? That's easy. We just need to find a hand. I bet you can get one, no problem. Hey, that's your plan? Cut somebody's hand off? But it works. Not here. There are heart rate monitors and infrared scan that check for blood flow. No blood flow, no unlock, no pass okay, around. Okay, fine. Then we, we grab someone alive and we get them to open it for us. No. The heart rate monitors will flag if he's nervous. Oh, okay, then we, we, we inject someone with a, with a sedative to bring down their heart rate. For fuck's sake, we already had a working plan here. Not with him! Junior, off. <laughs> oh. Now you listen to me. You don't get to walk in here like you own the place, okay? This is my garage. Mm -hmm. My hardware. He wants to turn Junior into a bomb. An EMP bomb, Trojan horse style. We hit the right hardware, fry the database, and the doors reset to the default codes. Easy fucking peasy. And all we need is the defaults. Mm. It does work, man. One night. One night in the desert together. And the two of you are best friends? You know what? Go ahead, Marcus. Go ahead. Take his side, okay? Don't let me get in the way, right? Hey, grow the fuck up, son. Fuck you, say to me! Hey, 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 Hold on. <laughs> Chill out, man. Chill out. How do we get him inside? Well, first of all, <clears throat> we're gonna have to get rid of all this meaningful propaganda. Stop. Guys, stop. Just keep the paint. When one of these things breaks down, 
Titus picks him up from a service depot. Oh. That's your way to get him inside. Huh. That's good. That's very good. Nice French. French. Right, all right. <laughs> Let me roll when you are, Marcus. Yeah. Ray has caused so many rifts in our group. Got Junior loaded up and back? Yep, he's in there. So, will MacGyver and EMP at the repair depot? Hard to believe that's all you really need to break into the world's top security company. Well, not counting the $36,000 robot you stole. So what you're saying is, I'm the key contributor in this plan. Nah, I'm saying you're basically a shoplifter. A highwayman. Highwayman? Oh, I like that. The masked highwayman stalks the twilight roads. Ever searching for the kingdom's most treasured relics. No job is too small or too demeaning for the masked highwayman. The masked highwayman and his underperforming but big hearted companion, the dark stranger. <laughs> you know what? I take back, highwayman. You're now the masked cracker. The masked cracker. What a name. What a game. Let's get this robot into Titus Court. But yeah. <laughs> Ray is a great hacker, but he's caused problems with Tara. Now, Wrench, man, he's just... I don't know what it is about him. Why do they assume the worst? Or is it the fact that he comes in and acts like he knows what they're doing, and these people think this is their, you know, their whole operation, and that they don't want it to be overran by some outsider? Alright. Out of the vehicle we go. Ooh, I need the parts. Okay. All right, I'm gonna whip us up a nasty little EMP bomb. I don't think I'll have a problem finding the right parts in this place. Man, the robots we could build in here. Yeah, maybe next time. The robots we could Wait. build in here. Restricted area. I wonder if I can, if I can like fly my. Oh, I could get right there. And there's one dude there, uh, there's a security box there, a forklift there, a camera there, a mad robot dart. So I can open this, and then I gotta get into this big old building here. But that is locked down. What is that locked? Oh, someone has a hack inside. Okay, let's grab a camera indoors. There we go. Okay, access key acquired. Is it the correct access key though? Let's see. Yes, it is. Now that door is open. So like that is, okay, so we just gotta get in there, okay. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, my baby. All right, so let's go for a little quick swim. I like the music for this one. Kind of a calm tune. As we uh, roll through the ocean, I, I really genuinely love this game so much more than I expected. It's such a pleasant surprise because it's kind of been a thin fall. Like, if you look at the release schedule, not as many games as most years. A lot of them got back shifted to January, February, March, stuff like that. So uh, it's, a little, it's a little bit low on game releases, but it's okay when they're really good. And luckily, we've had a good number of really good ones. And this has been one of the best yet. Hopefully the rest of the slate Pokemon Final Fantasy Last Guardian can deliver similar star-studded performances to really fill out uh, what's otherwise kind of a thin fall. Like I said, one of the, the smaller years since I've done YouTube. Pick up the phone, baby. No. I'm in the zone, baby. All right, cool. Get whipped. Does that robot ever leave that space? Yeah, where you gonna go? Bye! Cool, 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 okay. Everything is in order. Open sesame. I have to grab that part? Okay. 
cheese. Oh, mm, macaroni, macaroni. All right, let's get the one up here first. This seems to be the easiest, best bet. And we're gonna turn poor Junior into a bomb. All right, the first EMP part is this. Looks like money, but I think it's actually a, like a circuit board. Oh my darling, that was close. Let's just get that guy out of here right now before things get uggles. All right, looks like we got two. Oh, it's two robots. Power the robots down. Grab the part. I can't see the second guy, but he should be okay. Oh, okay. God. Holy macaroni. You just get a cute picture? Dude, his girlfriend be sending him pics on the job. Can we close this garage? Okay. Ooh. These guys make me so nervous. Is he going to fix the robot? I think that's what he's going to do. That guy's just going to make a cycle. Call him again, and let's get the part. Okay. Wrench, I got the EMP ready. Where's Junior now? I got him ready at the drop-off zone. Can you get the door for me? You got it. Where's the door, baby? Okay. Let's go upstairs again. So we got to get over there and open the door. I want you think we can do it via camera? Let's see. We're doing good thus far. No, this is not going to work. Mm, okay. I think I'm going to send in not him. This guy. Good, everything's being powered down. And now we about to open the door for Wrench so we can bring Junior in and arm him up EMP style and blow this place crazy. Oh, there's Wrench. And he's gonna push him in here. Poor little guy is gonna turn into a bomb. Even though, aren't they gonna recognize like, why does this one have such a weird paint job? Aww, he's showing some love to the little robot. Bye, Wrenchy Boo. Okay. Plant I have to go plant the EMP on him? Alright. 
Okay, so I think... Oh, I want to call back my... This guy. There. I love how we can just, like, call him back and he just becomes part of us again. I think that's so awesome. Like, come to me, my fair child. Mm okay, so this... Planting the bomb on him involves going down here and making sure these robots don't see me. Which, which one did I just power down? I don't even know which one. This guy coming right her, right her. Let's just drop attack him. I, I do not know. Oh, we just shut off. There. He has been powered down. Okay. In we go. Let's use our parts. Build this EMP. And then get the heck out of her. Hey, little junior, okay, I'm sorry. Guy, today is your day. Make us proud. Objective complete, baby. Leave the depot. Alright, Junior's ready for pickup. Next stop, Titus. Ranch, you and I need to powwow. I have an idea. I'm sending you some coordinates to follow. Ooh, a special mission. Marcus, you meet me outside Titus when you're ready. Near the big Silicon Valley sign. Are you running the show now? Nope. This one's going to be mostly Marcus, but I'm going to do everything I can to make sure he gets in there. I'll see you there, Ray. Beautiful. The robot wars continue. Followers gain. And we are at 2.58 million. We got to meet Ray near the Silicon Valley sign. So let's see where that is on the map. Where are we? Oh, we're up here. It's actually not that far of a drive, really. If I can just grab a car. Um, and we do have cars on demand. So let's grab... Uh, ooh, here. We can put whatever paint job on we want. I think this one's new. Ooh, also these creepy skeletons. But I kind of like the green. Or the... Yeah, I like the green. Let's go with that. And then we'll call in this car. And it's right here. Oh, yeah. That one looks cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Let's drive straight to the Silicon Valley sign, which is... Oh, it's not that far. We'll get there in no time. Go up here, swing a left and see what Ray has planned now that we've set an EMP. And Titus is probably going to get blown, not sky high, but shock high, electrical high. Now let's, oh, wow. Okay. Marcus, you got this. Keep the car under control. It's got a cool sound system, like a, a, a front console in there is looking really good. There's a bike race here, but we're going to go straight towards the moon, over the hill, and make our way to the sign. There's the Silicon Valley sign. We can just drive on it. Sorry, Silicon Valley. Did I take out some of the letters? No, I didn't. Okay. Silicon Valley Tech City, and we're here. And there's a bike here, and there's me here. And we're ready to go. Ray, what you got planned for Mr. Marcus in the Robot Wars? 